to simply talk about wine in grocery stores is is a fallacy. There's a lot more that goes into it than just wine in grocery stores. Um, there's there's a there's a huge uh, change in how the state manages it and how uh, the cities and the counties and everybody else manages alcohol. Um, you know, as we've said many times, alcohol is not Coca-Cola and it's not cookies. And it's it's an addictive product that can cause harm to a third party. Um, you know, there are people that misuse this. Um, there are people who are under 21 who try to buy this product. Uh, teenage drinking is an issue. Uh, we are aware of how we handle that product. Most of us do a very good job of it. It's a tough job. The yeah. state of Tennessee, when they passed the laws, chose to treat wine as an alcoholic product. Well, it is. I mean, there's no, there's no two ways about it. And they chose to treat beer under 6% alcohol as uh, beer. Anything above that is treated as alcohol. And those laws have been in place since 1923, I guess is the year. The, the point being is, is that liquor stores have only been able to sell those products and nothing else. Uh, we can't sell mixers. We can't sell anything else. So when the grocery, you know, when you look at my business or our business, uh, you know, I sell one product. I sell alcohol. 